American anti-LGBT politician Wes Goodman is facing fresh allegations of sexual misconduct from more than 30 men having already resigned after being caught having extramarital sex with a man in his office, along with the news that had been having sex with an unidentified man at his place of work. Apparently this is far from the full story. According to an exclusive report by the Independent Journal Review, there are now new accusations from over 30 individuals. The report claims he would regularly take to Facebook Messenger and pretend to be a mentor to men in the 1824 age range. The conversations would reportedly then turn sexual and explicit, and at times, even directly soliciting sex. Credit NCB4E thought it would be a great way to build a professional relationship with an upcoming conservative lawmaker and seemingly solid guy, an anonymous source told the Independent Journal Review. However, he constantly sent me snaps and was always commenting on my stories. He also asked how much PY I was getting and wondering what I was doing on Friday and Saturday nights. The source also reveals how he was sent videos of Goodman masturbating, along with dick pics. The report also mentions allegations against Goodman that date back several years, including one in relation to an 18-year-old boy back in 2015. This came after Goodman was recently caught having sex with a man in his office. We all bring our own struggles and our own trials into public life. That has been true for me, and I sincerely regret that my actions and choices have kept me from serving my constituents and our state in a way that reflects the best ideals of public service, Goodman said in a statement, following his resignation. For those whom I have let down, I'm sorry. As I move on to the next chapter of my life, I sincerely ask for privacy for myself, my family, and my friends. Many of Goodman's social media accounts have either been deleted or have been made private. According to Ohio newspaper The Toledo Blade, Ohio House Speaker Rep. Cliff Rosenberger has said a committee will be chosen to screen for Goodman's replacement. Featured image credit U.S. Gov.